Inhibin A. Inhibin A is a protein hormone related to pregnancy which is a screening marker of Down syndrome. A serum sample is from the mother and radioimmunoassay, RIA, may be used to analyze the sample. Islet cell antibody. Inhibin A. Inhibin A is a protein hormone related to pregnancy which is a screening marker of Down syndrome. A serum sample is from the mother and radioimmunoassay, RIA, may be used to analyze the sample. Islet cell antibody. Leukocyte histamine release test, LHR. This test is performed to quantify the levels of histamine. The specimen is plasma. Urine is collected over a 24-hour period. Methods are fluorometric, radioenzymatic, and immunoassay. Leukocyte phagocytosis. The specimen is whole blood. Method is flow cytometry or fluorescence microscopy. Cellular function assay involving stimulation, e.g., mitogen, or antigen, and detection of biomarker, e.g., ADP. This cellular function assay detects CMI in whole blood in immunosuppressed patients by measuring their early response to immune system stimulation and detection of adenosine triphosphate, ADP, a biomarker. Lymphocyte transformation mitogen, phytomitogen, or antigen-induced blastogenesis. This test may also be requested as lymphocyte mitogen response test or phytohemagglutinin, FA, stimulation. This test is used to determine the adequacy of early immune response using nonspecific mitogens or specific antigens as transforming agents capable of inducing blastogenesis. B cells, total count. This test may also be referred to as a B lymphocyte assay. B cells, also known as B lymphocytes, are responsible for making antibodies. B cells develop and mature in the bone marrow. The specimen is whole blood. The quantitative number of B lymphocytes is determined using flow cytometry. Mononuclear cell antigen, quantitative, e.g., flow cytometry, not otherwise specified, each antigen. Using specific antibody labeling with flow cytometry measurement, this test detects the amount of specific antigens on mononuclear cells, lymphocytes, dendritic cells, monocytes, macrophages. Natural killer, NK, cells, total count. This is a blood test that provides a total count of target cells that are killed by natural killer, NK, cells. The specimen is whole blood. NK cells are separated from the blood and are cultured at different dilutions with target cells from an embryonic cancer cell line. These target cells have been tagged with cytoplasmic dye. Flow cytometry is used to identify the target cells that have been killed by the NK cells. Flow cytometry is used to precisely count the percentage of dead to live cells at the different dilutions. T cells, total count. This test may also be referred to as T cell assay, T cell analysis, or T cell study. The specimen is whole blood. Whole blood is added to fluorochrome labeled antibodies, also referred to as monoclonal antibodies, which bind specifically to cell surface antigens on lymphocytes. This is used in conjunction with flow cytometry to obtain the total T cell count. This test is used to type and classify different types of lymphomas and lymphocytic leukemias as well as to monitor immunodeficiency states, including HIV infections. T cells, absolute CD4 and CD8 count, including ratio. T cells, absolute CD4 count. This test may also be requested as T4 slash T8 ratio. Whole blood is added to fluorochrome labeled antibodies, 
also referred to as monoclonal antibodies, which bind specifically to cell surface antigens on lymphocytes. This is used in conjunction with flow cytometry to obtain the CD4 and CD8 cell counts. This test is used primarily in staging HIV infection and monitoring the effects of treatment. Stem cells, i.e., CD34, total count. Periodic blood samples are obtained to determine total amounts of circulating CD34 plus cells. Flow cytometry is used to identify specific stem cell subtypes and to determine total counts of CD34 plus cells. Using this test the physician can determine when the total number of circulating stem cells containing CD34 plus is sufficient to begin harvesting stem cells for subsequent transplant. Microsomal antibodies, e.g., thyroid or liver kidney, each. This test is performed to determine the presence of antithyroid microsomal antibodies. The specimen is serum. A hemagglutination test for thyroid antigens is used and, if that test is positive, it is followed by a fluorescent scan to show a decrease or absence of thyroid stable iodine. Neutralization test, viral. Tissue samples may be collected by biopsy. Fluorescent dye may be used to identify the target virus directly from clinical specimens or tissue. Neutralization tests are used in various serological tests to identify antibodies to the target virus in serum, i.e., herpes simplex virus. The identification aids in the diagnosis of diseases caused by the virus. Specimen type varies. Neutralizing antibody, severe acute respiratory syndrome coronavirus 2, SARS-CoV-2, coronavirus disease COVID-19, screen, titer, severe acute respiratory syndrome coronavirus 2, SARS-CoV-2, coronavirus disease COVID-19, antibody, quantitative. Nitro Blue Tetrazoleum Dye Test, NTD. This code also may be ordered as Nitro Blue Tetrazoleum, NBT. The specimen is whole blood. A biochemical assay and simple laboratory equipment, microscope, incubator, and centrifuge, are used to detect phagocytosis and intracellular killing of microorganisms by normal polymorphonuclear neutrophils. Nuclear matrix protein 22, NMP22, qualitative. Nuclear matrix protein 22, NMP22, is a tumor indicator for bladder cancer when found in significant quantities in a urine specimen. Particle agglutination, screen, each antibody. Titer, each antibody. These tests may be ordered as PA. The specimen is serum. There are several methods used in tandem with PA tests, such as fluorescence enzyme assay and scattered light flow cytometry. Particle agglutination, PA, tests may be performed to evaluate immune status to and diagnosis certain viruses, i.e., measles virus infection. Rheumatoid factor Qualitative. Quantitative. This test may be ordered as rheumatoid antibody, RA, arthritis screen, or rheumatoid factor, RF. The specimen is serum. Testing methodology is by latex agglutination, ELISA, or nephilometry. Tuberculosis test, cell mediated immunity antigen response measurement, gamma interferon. Enumeration of gamma interferon producing T-cells in cell suspension. Testing is conducted by mixing fresh blood samples with antigens and controls, antigens, methods of testing, and criteria for interpretation differ. Skin test procedure method. Two testing methods are, 
the intradermal test and the prick test. A standardized concentration of the antigen is introduced into the skin of the arm, usually by needle or skin prick. The test site is examined within 30 minutes and again at 24, 48, and 72 hour intervals. Evidence of a reaction is recorded. This test has limited value diagnostically and usually provides supporting information only. Skin test, Candida. This test may be ordered as Candida Delayed Hypersensitivity Testing, DHT or DHR. Skin test, unlisted antigen, each. Test, coccidioidomycosis. This test may be ordered as coccidioides delayed hypersensitivity testing, DHT or DHR. It may also be ordered as cocci skin test. Skin test, histoplasmosis. This test may be ordered as histoplasma skin test. Skin test, tuberculosis, intradermal. This test may be ordered as TB skin test, TB delayed hypersensitivity testing, DHT or DHR, tuberculin skin test, MAN2 test, or purified protein derivative test, PPD. A standardized concentration of tuberculin PPD is introduced into the skin of the arm. The method is intradermal. Culture extracts of tuberculin proteins in a test dosage is injected intradermally, forearm. The test site is examined at 24, 48, and 72 hour intervals for evidence of induration. Evidence of a reaction is recorded. Streptokinase, antibody. This test is commonly ordered as ASO. The specimen is serum. The test may be performed by latex agglutination or enzyme-linked immunosorbent assay, ELISA. Syphilis test, non-treponemal antibody, qualitative, e.g., VDRL, RPR, ART. Quantitative. This non-treponemal, screening, antibody test is commonly ordered as RPR, rapid plasma reagent, STS, serologic test for syphilis, VDRL, venereal disease research laboratory, or ART, automated reagent test. It may also be ordered as standard test for syphilis. The specimen is serum. The method is by nontroponemal rapid plasma reagent, RPR, particle agglutination test. Antibody, actinomyces. This test is commonly ordered as anti-actinomyces or actinomyces antibody titer. The specimen is serum. The methods are, complement fixation, CF, immunodiffusion, agglutination assay, and western blot, immunoblot. Antibody, adenovirus. This test is commonly ordered as anti-adenovirus titer or adenovirus antibody titer. The specimen is serum. The methods are, complement fixation, CF, immunofluorescent, and enzyme-linked immunosorbent assay, ELISA. Antibody, aspergillus. This test is commonly ordered as anti-aspergillus titer or aspergillus antibody titer. The specimen serum. The methods are, complement fixation, CF, counterimmunoelectrophoresis, radioimmunoassay, immunofluorescence, enzyme-linked immunosorbent assay, ELISA, and immunodiffusion. Antibody, bacterium not elsewhere specified. The specimen is serum. The methods are, complement fixation, CF, immunofluorescence, and enzyme-linked immunosorbent assay, ELISA.